<laughs> so, topic of the month. Men next month. Exactly. Men. The unappreciated men. <laughs> well, I don't know if I'd say that. <laughs> I think. And I'm so glad you're here because you have a lesser great experience, I think, with men <laughs> than I have had. <laughs> By a million miles, yes. By a million miles, exactly. <laughs> so, I'm glad you're here because it's going to be an, an interesting. Mm -hmm. I think it's going to be interesting. It's just going to get better. Keep we have watching. two very different views. Mm -hmm. We might. The friendship might not survive. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'll be arguing what I think about men. <laughs> Which is, is no, an open debate. <laughs> Prepare your points. See you next week. <laughs> dancing class? Was it hard? I didn't do, I didn't do the last one. Oh, I have been in pain since. She, I don't know how she moves her body I the way she does. I'm so jealous of it. I'm just like, um, like, when she's like, move your shoulders without making your hip thing yeah. shake. I'm just like, how do you even do I that? Even like, I move my shoulders and my entire body jiggles. <laughs> Everything jiggles. Right? I just, I don't understand. It is so difficult. It's so like, hard. My shoulders are also in pain since the class. What am I trying to do? She's a really good teacher, but she's amazing. Jeez, I just don't know she's how she moves wonder, the way she does. I want to be when I grow up. Right? Oh, I want to try um, Kelsey. What's that her name? Kelsey. I want to try her. I see she has her CBD yes, spray, spray out for sale now. Yeah. Yes. I want to try that because I go through so much after sun in the summer. Really? I never uh, use it, to be honest. So. Oh, God. I always buy, like, the biotherm, and it's, like, you know, $40 oh. for a bottle, and I go through at least two of those in the summer because uh, my skin is so fair. I burn, like, yeah, in, in a second, and the biotherm stuff, it really, like, it saved me from a few really bad sunburns. Yeah. yeah. I don't, I don't need that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's, maybe they don't know. Maybe we should maybe say a little bit where we're at. I have one husband, only had one, <laughs> and two kids. I've been married six years, and my parents actually have been married. I'm 30. They are married. What, 32 years? And my, what do you think? That's a lot of years. Mm -hmm. And my in laws have been married 30, like me. So we come from very, very. <laughs> Couples that stay yeah, together for yeah, a Yeah, exactly. Time. Uh, traditional, <laughs> I'd say. Traditional family. Traditional. Mm -hmm. And how about you? So, my parents have been married for 47 years, and oh I God. come from a very traditional family, but I married um, a guy, a, guy, <laughs> a man, and I was married for 10 years, we were together for 12 years, and I mean, to put it short, he was just very abusive in many ways. Um, so I don't have such a great opinion <laughs> on marriage yeah. anymore. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the guy you were dating before, was mm -hmm. he a, play a part in your disbelief in men? <laughs> I thought I was dating somebody different, and don't get me wrong, it was nothing like my, yeah. my ex-husband. Nobody is like him, but... And this guy was not abusive whatsoever, mm -hmm. um, but self, very selfish. He was yeah. very selfish, and I am not that way. Mm -hmm. um, and I don't like being made to feel like I'm that way or told I'm that way uh, when I okay. know I'm. That's not what I'm like. Mm -hmm. So that it just you know 
broke down big time over time. Hmm. Excellent gardener. I had I didn't know and you could keep tomatoes in the freezer. Shares her knowledge. Okay. Because she's taught me a lot of things. She I mean, I've seen like tomatoes, you know, mashed down, kept in the freezer, but not like an entire tomato like that. Yeah, all the little, well, the little huh. tomatoes. Yeah. Because they were most of small. That was the big one, but most of them, they were small. I just almost finished them. Huh. Because we had some stored from her and from us. The garden. She has a, a forest of tomatoes out there. That's awesome. The plant. Yes. From yeah. It's great. You call them. Or I, I didn't even have to call them. I texted them. Okay, yeah. Said, hey, do you have plants? Yes, we have. We have OJ Kush or cookies and cream. That's Excellent. pretty handy. I need this. So he said the free shipping is for $25. Do you want something else? I said, uh, How much were the plants? Sure, gummies. <laughs> 15 Oh, that's good. And they have free shipping after 25 Huh. Um, That's a pretty good deal, actually. That is an excellent deal. Mm -hmm. I thought it was great. So I said, get me, and then I got gummies, which I haven't tried. Uh, I like gummies. But I say 500 milligrams each. I think I'll die if I have it. I guess. That's a lot. No, thank you. I will die. Yeah, you need to just, like, cut off a piece I'll be of the that. first dead person to die. <laughs> I mean, I don't think you would die, but I think you would be really messy. <laughs> and they, well, they gave me a lollipop, like a free compliment okay. lollipop. Okay, yeah. Well, have you had a lollipop before? <laughs> yeah. I didn't have the whole thing because I thought if I do this, I will die. Yeah. For most likely. <laughs> so I just have uh, like a bite, yeah. maybe less than half. And then I started feeling it very, really smoothly, very nicely. So then I gave it another bite. And I, it took me like that all day. A nice, constant Nice. Taste. I like that. Yeah. It was perfect. An excellent day. That's we got awesome. A, we got the hot tub. <laughs> it was pretty there yeah. to be able to do life. Yeah. <laughs> but That's awesome. Just there. A little higher than that. <laughs> just than the rest one of level up. <laughs> just looking down at everybody for my room. Eventually, I'll tell you a little bit more about the whole plan mm -hmm. so that you can see where I was going at. It wasn't going to be like this. But, you know, maybe it is. Everything <laughs> is changing. Things, things take weird turns sometimes. My plan is to dedicate each month to a specific thing, mm -hmm. always, and explore a different aspect of that thing through the years. Mm -hmm. So, in January it was self-growth, in February we did love, mm -hmm. in March we did habits, uh, so personal, personal, personal growth, like physically personal, not so much intellectual, but physical. Um, then, Maybe April with the children, women mm -hmm. on May, yeah. and then I thought, well, it's only natural that it's men. Do men. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mostly because uh, I have also a theory, another theory I have is that a lot of the problem is systematic. Mm -hmm. Maybe a lot of the men haven't been they maybe don't have an outlet for self-care mm -hmm. as easy, uh, as accessible as we have it. So, this is it. This, this is the place. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this is where it all happens. Exactly. <laughs> We're only offering a solution here. Mental health solution. Because I think that's what the whole thing is. I think Mental it's... We're only... It's somehow more shameful to, for men to admit that they have mental health issues. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah, that too. It might be more difficult. Yeah, exactly. S systematic. Mm -hmm. All social. Yeah. So maybe explore different aspects of, of um, how to be... Like, how can men do self-care? How can men... 
ask them what are the problems there. Mm -hmm. So that's uh, that's the idea. Just send me your thoughts on this, because as you see, we're working on it. <laughs> and as not being and if, a man, if any men I don't watch have, exactly. and have, you know, a story to tell, they should contact yes, us. Yes, contact us, of course. Yeah. Yes. And then you can maybe share what helped you, what did not. Because a lot of also, like, there's a lot of great men, mm -hmm. I would say. <laughs> as much I as do they are awful I men, do agree with that. I think a, lo a yeah. lot of the things I learned from my dad, my husband's pretty good. But there's also a lot of, like, motivational speakers mm -hmm. that are men, a lot of writers who have been men. And a lot of those writers, pretty sad. <laughs> pretty sad lives. Yeah. But others, pretty good lives. So, I don't know. I think it's it's something to be explored. And not being a man, I think we have a, we have a problem. We have you some see the problem? to do. Come here. <laughs> we yeah. come with preconceived notions. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. So, you, we want you <laughs> to come here and chat with us. Join us for lunch. Join us for lunch. We do this every week. We're open to different schedules. Yep. I am. I either cook delicious food or we eat something from a re local restaurant mm -hmm. and then we chat about wellness. So yep. if you want to be well, get well with us. Get in touch with one of us. This is it. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> this is where you gotta come. <laughs> really. That's all. Peace out. Peace. <laughs>